when Siri and Alexa came out, they changed how we interact with our devices. Now that generative AI like ChatGPT is available, it's changing how we interact with our tools. All eGPT is observes generative AI assistance to help users troubleshoot incidents faster. Observe users can ask questions in plain English using a familiar chatbot interface to fetch data, extract fields, and make sense of error messages, and much more. AliGPT can even act as an assistant for on-call engineers to remediate an incident via Slack. AliGPT answers users' questions about how to perform common tasks, such as finding relevant data sets or what configuration to use in order to ingest Prometheus metrics. Hundreds of users summon AliGPT on a weekly basis. And with the Hubble release, we have fine-tuned it on our latest documentation and best practices. With Hubble, AliGPT provides users with more data insights. For example, highlighting an error message in a log now explains that error message regardless of source, Go language or web server or Kubernetes. In addition, new logs often arrive unstructured, so users may have to write complex regex statements to parse them before they can even perform analytics. This can be a nerve-wracking experience during an incident when time is precious. AliGPT not only generates the regex, but also names the resulting columns appropriately, such as URL or status code. With Hubble, AliGPT is now able to act as an incident assistant within Slack. The incident assistant can read observe alerts surfaced in a Slack channel and take the user to relevant log lines, inspect patterns, and help the user get to the root cause. You can even page the right on-call engineer if required. New users joining the incident Slack channel now benefit from an OliGPT generated incident summary, and when the incident is resolved, a conclusion and a timeline is generated for post-mortem use. OliGPT can also save these summaries for future reference, so if an error comes back, the hard-earned learnings are right there. In addition, you can upload your own runbooks, so help can be specific to your own context. Another use of generative AI is Opal Copilot that was introduced earlier this year. New users can now learn Observe's powerful query language, Opal, much more quickly than before. A user of Observe can type something like search errors in logs, count by container, and chart it, then immediately see and run the generated Opal code. To power Opal Copilot, we trained a private language model which not only reduces hallucinations, but it also improves performance and security. Customer data is held within Observe and is not accessible by third parties. More applications are using LLMs every day, so observing the data pipelines feeding those LLMs is becoming an important use case. Observe's OpenAI application provides out-of-the-box content so users can understand latency, error rates, and accuracy of responses that the LLM is providing. OliGPT and Opal Copilot use generative AI to provide a natural language interface for users to troubleshoot incidents. The rich contextual data in Observe makes it easier for generative AI to connect the dots for users and assist their troubleshooting through a familiar chatbot interface. The Hubble release is a big step, but also the first step in leveraging this revolutionary technology. Yeah!